10 Shocking Facts on Electrical Safety, brought to you by the Electrical Safety Authority of Ontario. This year in Ontario, roughly 2,000 people will end up in the emergency room because of an electrical injury, and more than three quarters of these cases will be urgent. Sadly, some people die from electrical contact, and it can happen anytime. Many tragic deaths related to electricity happen at home when people are renovating or accidentally run over the cord while mowing the lawn. Some even happen on the job. Other deaths are due to people contacting power lines. At home, it could be a ladder or a kite. At work, it might be a dump truck. Any of these will conduct electricity if they touch power lines. Don't let it happen to you. Look up and locate the power lines first. Storms and accidents can knock down power lines. If you see one, remember electricity may still be flowing. Stay well back and call 911 to report the situation. Where there's electricity, there can also be risk, even in your own home. Everyday items like plugs, switches, lights, fans, and indoor and outdoor wiring can represent potential hazards. Flickering lights are a warning sign. So are breakers that constantly trip or fuses that constantly blow. A licensed electrical contractor can help make your home safer. This year, many fires will involve electric stoves and range top burners. Never leave a hot burner unattended and keep pot holders and other flammable materials well away. Have a look around the house for frayed, cut, or squashed cables. Damaged plugs, loose wiring connections, and other problems with electrical components in your house account for nearly two-thirds of wiring-related fires. Taking shortcuts when you're renovating can be costly and dangerous, especially when it comes to electrical work. Shoddy work can put you and your family at risk. Hiring a licensed electrical contractor is the best way to ensure the job's done right. Nearly 60% of homeowners who do electrical work admit they're not very experienced. If you're not sure what you're doing, hire a licensed electrical contractor. Just two-thirds of Ontarians realize that if they hire someone to do electrical work, only licensed electrical contractors are legally allowed to do it. Too many pay the price of hiring the cheapest tradesperson and then having to fix mistakes later. When you're deciding who to hire, look for their ESA ECRA license number. Always shut the power off at the breaker panel or fuse box before starting any electrical work. You could be seriously injured, or worse, if you don't. Keep your family and home safe. Learn how to spot potential electrical risks and how to avoid them.